Hello and welcome to another practical IT video. In this video, we are going to go over how to restore a virtual machine created in VirtualBox to Proxmox VE using RescueZilla. Let's get started. What we're going to do is we're going to create a new VM. And we're going to say vbox restore next iso image is going to be rescuezilla next and we're going to accept the defaults here hard drive 32 gigs is fine cpus one core we're going to give it two gigs of RAM, bridge networking. That all looks good. We're going to check start after created and click finish. And once that populates here, we'll move to the console. And we're booting up RescueZilla. And we're gonna follow the same restore procedure that we used in the video where we cloned a VirtualBox VM and restored it within VirtualBox. So once this gets booted up, we'll go through that process and we'll wrap the video. In all honesty, doing it in this manner does take some of the complexity out of the equation because you don't have to do a an export in VirtualBox, go through the procedure of converting the disk file and then doing the import in Proxmox VE. So let's do restore over the network. Next, and we are going to use the VM backup demo, and that's the one we want. Next, QEMU hard disk. Next, and yes, it's going to overwrite everything on the drive, and that'll get started here. And I will see all of you momentarily after this has completed. And in just a few more seconds, we should hit the end of this process. All right, restore in 1.3 minutes. Exit. We'll shut down RescueZilla. And while we're waiting for that to shut down, we're going to go to hardware and we are going to edit and remove media. And this should prompt us in just a moment to hit enter to continue and we can restart and make sure the machine works. All right, we've got our VM shut down successfully. And so we are going to go ahead and start this up and make sure it boots. And so far, everything is looking good. And we're good to go. And that will bring us to the end of another practical IT video. If you like the video, please take a moment, give a thumbs up, subscribe, click the bell icon for notifications, and feel free to leave comments down below. I want to thank everybody once again for watching. Stay safe out there. Happy computing and have a great day.